Welcome back, I'm Nicole BW, and this is Sky Factory 2. And today is just gonna be a short video. We're gonna go through the achievement book and mark off some of the things that we have done and do some of the things that are a little bit easier for us to achieve at this moment. So if we go through, go back, um, we have everything done up to use a sprinkler to water a farm. Uh, so I've set up the sprinkler over here down below on our farm over here. Where's it at? Okay. So we have a sprinkler. I have it sitting on a tank filled with water and below that is an aqueous accumulator with water sources on either side of that. Cactus. <laughs> I forgot there was cactus back there. Um, so we can mark that off. Yay. So we have farming age done. Uh, plant a flower in five biomes. So let's do that, shall we? We need five pieces of dirt and five flowers. Um, dirt. We will do one, two, three, four, five, and daisies. We have to use daisies because it's my favorite flower. They're just a happy flower. Okay, so if you look in the upper left, it says what biome things are. Uh, let's see. We have lots of plains around here. I think this is all plains. It sure is. Uh, let's go over here. I think there's different ones. Plains. Okay, beach. So we will do beach. Beach right here. So this is beach. Ocean. Ocean. Right here is ocean. Let's check F7. Make sure. Okay. Uh, ocean, beach, deep ocean, right here, right here, right here, deep ocean, beach, 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 plains, we will mark off plains right now, and we need one more, is there one more over here, because that would be awesome. I think this is all planes. Okay. Um, let's see. We need to find another one. Let's go over here. River and desert. River. I don't want to put it on the walkway. Okay. Um, desert. We'll just put it in the desert. We'll put it right here in the center. So there we go. We have planted five Planted a flower in five different biomes. So there we go. Had to drag an egg and train it. Not even close to that. Uh, creative passive cool reactor from Big Reactors mod. I do not remember what passive and active, what the difference are. Uh, but we've done one of them, so I'm checking off one. Then when we switch to turbines, I'll check off the other one. Uh, create the maximum size reactor. Now, the maximum size reactor is 32 by 32 by 48. So I was watching Wild last night on Twitch and he was creating, finishing up the max size reactor. And I realized I'm nowhere even near that, but I do have a better design than I had the last time, which will be amazing. It gets like, what was it, 70? thousand or 71,000 RF uh, a tick per block I think it was I, I don't remember it is like some ridiculous amount is very efficient so um turbine uh, produce a thousand RF a tick we are doing that let's go check our power usage because I have uh, changed some things up. I moved the deep storage units downstairs and moved some other stuff downstairs. I also moved these machines and um, 
the soul sand creation because it was kind of getting laggy with all these machines so i moved them out there uh, with the cobble gen and it seems to do a lot better so i think we're gonna have to uh yeah make uh, more of those actually so right now we are using about 3400 rf attack 33 3400 yeah uh so we're definitely over a thousand we are not quite ten thousand yet but we can produce more than that we're just not actually using it so and if we combined all of the magmatic dynamos and this we're probably producing more than 10,000 but we'll leave it we'll leave it uh, let's see uh, we've already done that we do not have the draconic stuff automate wither killing we did that last episode yay kill a chaos dragon no uh, we do not have that. Make a charm of dislocation. I have done that actually. Here's our charm of dislocation. Uh, so I put some ender pearls in there for the fuel. Uh, this is a fairly easy recipe. You need a wyvern corn, which means you need a nether star. And then uh, we were just waiting for more draconium dust, which I have found a couple more comets. To be able to do that so if i shift right click here are all the things that i have set up we have one for home which is in front of our a system one in the deep dark at our quarry one at the island over there for the cobble gen and one um, in the end at the portal so we have made that yay uh, so we can mark that off we have not resurrected uh, one of the dragons and we did not, <laughs> we haven't built any of the energy cores, which will be interesting, but I don't have nearly enough of the, of the stuff to make it. Yeah, uh, this is not even a question. <laughs> uh, fill a deep storage unit with anything. We do not have that done yet, not even close. Uh, produce 1 billion RF, no. Uh, we are not finished with our inner quarry in the deep dark. It's still running. It's probably about a fourth of the way done, maybe. I don't know, somewhere around there. Uh, once that gets done, then we'll turn another fortress into uh, dirt using the quarry. Uh, replace power cables with cryostabilized conduit. Uh, I really don't want to do that. Use diamond blocks to cool a max reactor. Again, we need a max reactor. Uh, we don't have this done. Uh, max size farming station for 20 crops. Done it. Yay. <laughs> and then fill one chunk completely with triple compressed cobble. Not done it yet. Um, but if we check our system, do we have? We probably don't have. No. We do not have a... Uh, octuple compressed cobble yet but if we fly over and it'll be kind of laggy when we fly over uh, if we fly over there we can check out what I've done and how I've moved stuff as it renders in so I put the machines and stuff down below I plan on making that whole bottom room machines now. Uh, so if we check here, we have two septuple compressed in there, and then one in there, and one in there. So we have four septuple compressed cobble. Not too bad. And then we have some sextuple compressed. So we're about to have six septuple compressed cobble soon. So that's not too bad. And then our uh, thing, let's see, three, three. So we have 13 million. That's not very much. <laughs> it's really not very much. This is not running very fast, but that's okay because we still have a lot to do. Uh, so I have made 12 barrels filled with, why is that all red? What is this?
Did I click on it by accident with something? I did. I clicked on it with uh, mushrooms. Okay, so we had to make that into dirt. Huh. Oh, and that one too. What the heck? Alright, well, let's gather some mushrooms and we'll finish this off into dirt. Okay, so when those are done composting and turning to dirt, wow, I <laughs> can't believe I did that. Okay, so there are, we should light that up so it doesn't spawn bad guys. Okay, so there's the render glitch bug, whatever, uh, for the witch water. So I'm making soul sand with 12 of them. Uh, whatever is available is going into here, which is getting sifted. The rest is going into the system. Uh, we have two of these running, making sand. We have these running. This is making dust, and these two are making sand. I have an octuple, uh, or an octactic capacitor in that, so it runs faster. And then we have 40 speed upgrades in that one, and in that one. Uh, so that way they run faster. Um, we don't really need, we have upgrades in this stuff, but yeah. So I think I'm going to take this setup right here and do it again. Uh, probably what, one, two, three, maybe three times, four, I could probably, maybe... Yeah, I could probably put one in each square between the lights. So I plan on making a whole bunch because we need a ton of Eulorium and a ton of um, redstone, although the redstone we can get from the magical crops, which are going like crazy. And it lags so much when I fly back and forth. I should use my charm to get back and forth. Um, yeah. As things load and unload, it's just laggy. Uh, so I can show you what I've done down below. Uh, I moved the loot recycler down here and put it, uh, export buses around for the different things that I want to recycle. And that for some reason, the broadsword is invisible for me. So I don't know what that's about, but I'm recycling it. Uh, I made a lot more of the deep storage units because a lot of the magical crop stuff, if we look in here, they're all like thousands and thousands. And it was filling up my, my, uh, my things up there. So... This is where I'm putting all the Eulorium, and yes, we are getting more, which is great. And then there's the Soul Sand and the Wither Skulls. So, and they just have export buses on the back. Uh, so yeah, all of these were filled in red, and then it was starting to come over here. So I, that's why I made more of the deep storage units. Uh, I kind of cleaned up the area a little bit, moved some things around. Also with the cows, uh, the ones that were filled up that I don't want more stuff of, like the witch water, stuff like that, uh, I'll use the witch water as an example, I went ahead and enabled this to high so it would stop working, and uh, as well as this, uh, I made it stop working. Uh, this had, um, what is this, Electrum in it for some reason, and I'm not sure why it got Electrum in it, so I had to fix that. Um, but yeah, so the ones that are filled up that I don't want more of, I've just shut off, so that way it's less machines running. Um, so once the barrels are filled, or the drums are filled with stuff, like the XP I really don't need, um, I can probably turn that off. Um, the glue, I don't really need either, so I, in, you know, 117 buckets of glue that I'm not going to use, 
I could probably turn that off as well, but I kind of, the completionist in me is like, hey, you should just go ahead, you know what, you can live. You should go ahead and keep that. Why? Uh, because it's, well, that sucks. Uh, we need dirt. There's some dirt, and we're going to need lights as well. Um, and I can't, whoa, whoa. Um, let's see. I should put some lights up. We'll put one there, and then we'll put one on the other side. I took down the glowstone nooks because the animals were getting caught on them. So I guess I should put torches up instead because, yeah. Either Endermen were stealing grass or, uh, yeah. Or creepers were blowing it up. I don't know. Uh, but this is going well. I put the zombies back in there. Um, this is so loud in my ear. Uh, this, not the dynamo. If you put the wyvern sword in there, you will have a chance of getting souls. Let me move out of the way. I feel like I'm yelling. Uh, you'll have a chance of getting the souls because you're using the draconic sword. So if we look in here, we now have 63 <laughs> wither souls and five zombie souls. So that's pretty cool. And it doesn't use any durability. So I don't have to uh, look at it, but it doesn't have beheading. So I'm not getting as many heads uh, for that. So I don't know. I, I think I'm gonna have to go back to the beheading but then again we have all of those skulls for the uh, wither that we don't have to worry about it too much right now uh, i also spawned zombies in here until i got a zombie villager so one of my goals i made a clipboard and i uh, have been making goals for myself and to-do list of things that i need to get done um, so I need to move the lava gin. Right now it's way up above and I want to move that over to the island next to the cobble gin. Uh, flowers and five biomes, we've done that. I want to turn the zombie villager into a regular villager and do something with the villagers. We don't really need them for emeralds uh, because we have the magical crops. So I don't know. I don't know what we'll do with them. Uh, but I want to do something. Maybe we'll just populate our little island here with a few upstairs and a few downstairs. Uh, that could be interesting. But I wanted to challenge myself and do that because I've never done that before. Uh, I need to make a tier 6 energy core. But in order to do that, I'm going to need some more of the draconic ore. Which means flying around the end a lot looking for comets. Which is not necessarily fun. Uh, we need to resurrect a dragon because we need a few more hearts to be able to make enough of the um, the draconic ingots. Yeah, let's let's look that up in our book, shall we? <laughs> the the um, so you have these the purple ones. Uh, the draconic ingots. Then you need the the orange ones, the awakened draconic ingots. In order to do that, you have to do the the um, the ritual. Oh, no, that's for yeah, that's for the dra uh, dragon ritual. Uh, so you have to do this whole ritual type thing with dynamite, TNT, you, with the dragon heart and the draconic 
stuff and cores and I don't know. I'm going to have to research that. But I know you need a lot of hearts. Not a lot, but you need a few. More than one, <laughs> if we only have one. So, uh, yeah. So we're going to have to resurrect a couple dragons and uh, in the end. So that should be interesting. Uh, the cryo duct, like I read in the achievement book, I'm just planning on making one, just one I'm going to make, and it's going to power the AE system. So that way I can make it big and I don't have to worry about power or anything like that. Uh, but yeah, I'm just making one because I don't want to replace everything, all of my cables with it. it I just don't like it. Uh, so we figured out the max size reactors, 32 by 32 by 48, uh, but we're going to need thousands and thousands of eulorium and redstone and all the extra stuff that goes with it, coal, diamonds, uh, because we need to cool the max size reactor with diamonds. Yeah, and I don't know what I'm doing with the dragon eggs, so I have to research that. So these are things that I plan on doing uh, sometime soon, but that's kind of the order in which I'm not how they're listed, but that's, yeah. Uh, so, oh, I can't talk today. Um, okay, so that's gonna be it for the video. I'm not gonna have a video tomorrow uh, because I have a ball to go to. Yes, a ball, like Cinderella, like a princess, a ball. I have to get ready for that. I have to go get my hair done and my nails done and all that pretty stuff uh, to, to look nice for my husband and everybody else that's gonna be at the ball. So, uh, I, yeah, I'm not gonna have time to do that. Uh, do a video tomorrow um, but that should be the last thing for a while that would stop me uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video I'm sorry it's just kind of a talky update let's go through the book kind of thing I didn't really do anything uh, but that's okay it kind of needed to be done and uh, I get to tell you guys that I'm going to a ball <laughs> so anyway um, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy playing Sky Factory 2. Hope you guys enjoy playing uh, Minecraft, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!